lots of bright and it's a wonderful day in the beautiful city of Saratoga. And what better spokeswoman do we have than Jill Hunter, who is the vice mayor of this absolutely stunning town. Well, I'd love to see you take an interest in our stores, and, and Nan, thank you so much for coming out. We have some wonderful stores here, and they have wonderful merchandise, and since it's right before the holiday season, we would love people to come out and shop in some of our great stores. So this store in particular is Agnes. Mm -hmm. It's called After the Owner, and uh, she and her daughter are the main people who are in the store all the time and they're just wonderful participants with everything that happens in the village and they have quite lovely merchandise so i wondered if i could show you what's in the store absolutely we'll go in and say hello to agnes all right okay. good come on in if we're going into agnes we'd have to at least say hello to agnes and there really is an agnes yes, this is a real agnes <laughs> how old is this property how long have you had this uh, uh, store it's almost three years now most of clothing is the korean designers and when you say korean designers does that mean they're made here or they're made in korea both, both. some of them is uh, from korea some of them is uh, uh work here so, so some of them is uh, imported from the Korea. Mm -hmm. Do, is there an age range, so like 40 to 60 or 30 to 50? Mm -hmm. or? I always say so 20 to 50s. Well, that takes in a lot of people. <laughs> <laughs> well, thank you so much. You're welcome. Thank you. <laughs> okay, please take a look. Okay. I want to say hello to Pauline. Hello. Hello. How are you? <laughs> and Merry Christmas, Happy New Year. Well, happy and, holidays. And this is uh, from Kesar to you and to our audience. And why don't you just tell us a little bit, Pauline, about the shop and what you sell here, and how a little a little bit about how long you've been here and what you mean to the city of Saratoga. But we have been here for a year and we have changed dramatically, you know, several times over the last year as we're trying to adapt to what Saratoga does not have. Mm -hmm. um, we, we ask for locals to tell us what they need and what they're looking for that they're not finding in town. And we brought in greeting cards and we have, you know, snacks and candy bars. These are all requests from people that live close by. And where I'm, I'm also uh, very much a visitor of all our other shops here and I will shop and buy locally but I also look to see what they're carrying so we're not going to duplicate it here mm -hmm. so we always try to uh, complement mm -hmm. and uh, fill the niches mm -hmm. that are uh, open. We have a lot of fun items as you could see we have a lot of Christmas items but we have a lot of other gift items as well we have crystal and toys and spa gifts so Something. We, also have, we also have our on online store that um, operates in the back part of our store the online store is uh, theobsessionboxco.com, and it carries a lot of the items we don't have here. So gift baskets and items like that are on the website. You must have fun when you go to Chicago or New York or wherever you go to shop. I love shopping. This has filled a niche for me because I'm a shopaholic, and it used to be clothes, and now I've shifted it over to buying things for the store, so it's actually a better better fit for me <laughs> I think it would be fun too I think I'll change my profession that's it for Come on not down. be a TV reporter I can have just you start tomorrow <laughs> <laughs> thank you so much thank you okay. thanks for coming by thank you thank you <laughs> you know I think I've just I think we've discovered here at KSAR KSAR our local television station what I call a treasure in a haystack yeah yeah definitely there's a there's a lot of things in this little small spot and and do you have regular customers I do I'm blessed with a lot of locals and certainly many people that come into the village uh, especially to see the concerts at the mountain winery mm -hmm. and they return year after year and come visit me and mm -hmm. so it's it's a mixed group of clients mm -hmm. And where do you, where is your merchandise when you go to shop? Do, 
Well, I attend the largest shows in the U.S., um, out of state, and I attend those several times a year. I also attend the aesthetic shows, mm -hmm. gift shows locally, and clothing shows locally. You hoping hoping to bring in what you won't find in the department stores. So you really search the field. I do. Well, I've been on this corner for the last 10 years and have tended to shows prior to that when I was in hospitality as well. So, yeah, I hope to bring the goods in, and I think my clients enjoy it. I do chase a lot of vintage, mm -hmm. uh, new vintage apparel. That, that. So now you said vintage apparel. Why don't you just show us something that you think is very unique and is in that vintage classification? I think my purses here in the background uh, speak to vintage. They have a Bakelite look to them. Um, I also have a hat collection on the other side of the shop. And anything I can find that's sort of vintage inspired. Mm-hmm. And you stick to your gun. This is very, very exciting. Try to make it unique. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I'm a little bit of everything from hair accessories to soaps and lotions and, of course, our product line, which is Skin Prophecy. We have a clinic in Montecito, and uh, I have a base of clientele here also that use the product line. And uh, mostly jackets in this small spot. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> I'd have fun if I could stay here all day and try everything on. <laughs> Bless your heart. <laughs> That's very kind. Well, I really invite great. all of Saratoga to come in and check me out. I know I'm small, but listen, I've we got in, it going. we invite all of Saratoga to come in and visit and shop here as well. Certainly, and I, I certainly thank those that have already been in. Thanks, and a happy holiday to you. Thank you. Happy holidays to you, too. Thanks. Here we are from KSAR. We're talking to Jim, 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 Jim. Jim who? Smothers. Jim Smothers. Oh, you got sort of a famous name, don't you? Fewer and fewer people recognize that anymore. <laughs> So why don't you just tell us a little bit about this shop and why it's unique and why everyone in this city should know that you have very, very special selections. Well, we're a wine and gift shop and uh, full of unique gifts. Uh, we have yet to obtain our wine license, but um, that's coming soon. And we have a lot of items that are relate to the wine uh, business and households and why don't you just show us why don't you just show us a few of them we'll go out and you'll get out All right. well some of the things that have proven to be real popular are little wine caddies a unique way to present a bottle of wine as a gift that is they, very unique they they have been very popular mm -hmm. uh over here are some things that um, are also quite unique and popular uh just Unique and popular. Made. Why don't you get a little closer to me? Custom made um, wine glasses. Now, the, these are these? Stems. Oh, do these it's all have hand blown? And uh, so they come in. Uh, we have we have several Christmas uh, themed ones, and then we have uh, ones that uh, suit all year round. I think that is really. They're really great. And from the same people come a beautiful line of glass stoppers. This is, happens to be a purple dragon. Very nicely made. And uh, this is kind of our theme lady here. Uh, a wine lady, we call her. Actually, it's, theme, it's called Lady with Grapes, but uh, anyway. Um, Those are unique. They yes, are unique. I and, and, and back here is our wine, our would-be wine department, where we're going to specialize in wine pairing. Uh, we're going to uh, supply uh, recipes with a lot of our wines. Uh, we're going to get together with, uh, oh, mm, we haven't really nailed down the details yet, but we want to get together with the chocolate shop next door and package up chocolates and big red wines and ports because they, they are natural pairings. Where, who are your customers? I mean, you have all kinds, but the majority of your customers, do they come from the city of Saratoga? Quite a few do, but I've been really surprised at how many people are uh, tourists. 
this this town gets a lot of tourists. Uh, who knew? So a lot of uh, people, a lot of British, a lot of Scots, Europe, lots of Europeans. Not to mention you know, East Coasters and uh, everything else. But um, but uh, so kind of evenly even between uh, locals and and tourists, surprisingly. And and I I think that you know I'm not. I don't live in Saratoga, but if I did, I sure would want to know about what you have here. Well, um, word's slowly getting out, I guess. We had the big, uh, uh, what was it called? Uh, Saratoga by candlelight uh, the day after Thanksgiving and the wine stroll. And we had over 200 people come through the store and um, many of them said, uh, oh, we didn't know you were here. So. Uh, it's well, getting out. maybe a few more people will know that you are here and turn on Channel 15 and see Kesar and their coverage of oh, these so. little, really, really wonderful tidbits about the city of Saratoga. Right. And it is very special. Thank you so much. Oh, thank you. you. I just had a feeling, Jill, that when we came to Chocolate Chops, you would say, here I am. I want to talk about sure. a chocolate shop. The Saratoga Chocolates is a very, very wonderful store that's been here now six years. Mm -hmm. And the owner, Mary Loomis, is out back and unfortunately avail unavailable at the moment. But I just wanted you to see what a selection she has. And this is a great day, place to come during the holiday season. They've got Santa Clauses and they have beautiful chocolates. And they have all kinds of great things. And so come to Saratoga Chocolates. Do they make these or are they oh, yes. You can see back there, they're, they're back there making chocolates right as we speak. You know what? They should have a, a draft going outside to the street. <laughs> because if they're making things here and you could smell it out there, it would pull the people in. Yeah. Now, how about that for a market? Yes. Yeah. Well, that would be terrific because it does smell wonderful in here and it's a wonderful shop. Yeah. And uh, we're very happy to have them here and very proud that they're here and a lot of people come by and, and get their you know, Christmas goodies and their holiday goodies here. And the, we'll, we'll just repeat the name of the store is? Saratoga Chocolates. That's your On easy. Big Basin, Basin Way. Way. Yes. That's easy to remember. Okay. <laughs> Thank you so much. Thanks. Hi, I'm Deja from Deja & Co. Exquisite Jewels. Uh, as you know, we're located in the beautiful village of Saratoga. First of all, we love it here. Uh, we were warmly received eight years ago now. We were a 38-year-old business. We were 30 years in Cupertino, eight years in Saratoga. Uh, we love being here. The residents are of a very uh, warm and welcoming community. We carry jewelry, um, fine jewelry um, in many price ranges. We range from $100 up to $300,000. $300,000? Three hundred what do you get for $300,000? Um, an exquisite, very rare, the very finest Pariba tourmaline ring with diamonds in a custom design. That would be your high end. But we started $100 gift items and um, everywhere from platinum, gold, and sterling to pearls. Um, my favorite is the rare and unusual gemstones. And we also have the very finest and the best pricing on diamonds. We can't be beat. Uh, we have an excellent uh, bridal counter. Um, Paul here is our diamond bridal expert. And um, we're mostly here to serve the community. Uh, we have the very finest in customer service, and we plan to be here as we have been for 38 years for a very long time and service you for a lifetime. Well, I tell you, you're a great spokesperson. <laughs> <laughs> you really are. 38 years, you're going to be here another 138 years. That's right. That's the plan. <laughs> <laughs> and so when you look around and so forth, uh, and I'm sure you have your favorites, but is there any item here that you say, wow, this is something I want to keep close to my heart. Is there one item like that here? Oh, yes. Why don't I show you that item we were talking about? But there are several close to my heart. We have everything you can imagine. Um, we're often told that 
we have the best selection of jewelry that anyone has ever seen. But hold on, let me grab that for you. It's right nope. um, It's a copper and manganese bearing tourmaline, very, very rare. Originally from the Paraiba mine in Brazil, it is now also found in uh, parts of Africa. And this one is exquisite. I don't know if you can see it. Here's a top view. And then here is a beautiful side view. But there is really no other stone that achieves this kind of color and brightness. The nickname is electric tourmaline. So and if I want to walk out of here with that ring, first of all, is it for March? I mean, I think that's my birthstone. Oh, no. You are aquamarine, the color of your eyes. Yes. And I can. And we have gorgeous aquamarines here I can show you. So that's a great birthstone for you. Tourmaline is one of the birthstones for October. And there are two birthstones in October, um, opal and tourmaline, both gorgeous. So the lucky people born in that month. Uh, but anyone can have a tourmaline, I think. We also have things from $100 on up. And most of our items probably range between $300 and $10,000, but we have things on either end of that as well. Well, you sure are in the right location. Saratoga can support this beautiful, wonderful extravagance, and uh, we wish you a very, very happy season. Thank you, and thank you for the support. We love it here. <laughs> nice. We have with us... You are Patrick Rupert. Patrick Rupert, and I know this is the time for you. And why don't you tell us just a little bit about how you're getting ready for the holiday season? And everybody's going to be knocking on this door. Well, I hope so. Uh, we are buying lots of wine for the uh, public. Uh, so between now and Christmas Day, it's going to be very big for us. We're bringing in uh, non wine gifts and wine gifts. Um, and we do have a tasting bar that's open uh, uh, Tuesday through Saturday uh, from 4 until 9 o'clock. We do encourage people having fun. And listen, the holidays should be all about fun, and you're a big part of the mix. Well, thank you very much. Okay. <laughs>